Yay, I'm live. How does it get any better than that? Hello, amazing people. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. And I'm just going to open up my Facebook just in case there's any questions. Um, hello, happy Saturday. How are you doing today? I am in Maidenhead in London facilitating foundation class. Okay, so I'm going to put my phone on here in case people come in and have some questions. And today I'm going to talk about something called access bars. Okay, so if you're out there and you know that life can be better, you actually know that life can be better. And every time you look to have a better life, to create a better life, you come up against these barriers and walls. And how I would, how I would explain that to you, it's like there's this old analogy that there's this glass box with a ceiling on it and they put these little fleas into this box and every time the flea jumps it jumps it jumps and it keeps jumping and it keeps jumping and the lid is like this and the flea jumps comes back down now the thing about this is the flea gets so used to jumping and gets so used to hitting off the lid the limitation let's call it that when they take the lid off guess what the flea jumps only to the height of where the lid did remain, was. So there's this thing called access bars. What access bars are about is, I'm just going to ask you the question. Do you actually know that you can create anything, that you can be anything, that you can do anything, and that you can generate anything? Now, if you have a yes to that, amazing, fantastic. Like, how does it even get any better than that? If you're out there and you have been brainwashed into believing that limitation is real and true, like me, that you have thoughts, emotions and feelings that are limiting you and don't allow you to go beyond, let's call it that glass ceiling. You'd really like to have a better life. For some reason, there's this energetic barrier. There's this energetic wall that you just cannot get through. Welcome to Access Bars. So access bars, I found access bars seven years ago and you come in, you get a session, you lie on a bed, a person touches points on your head. Now, this is the thing, folks. We, from the time of utero, we physiologically and psychologically are taking points of views from our parents. We actually create our body in a mimicry of our parents' physiology and psychology, our cultures, physiology, and psychology. What does that mean? You look like your mom. You sometimes speak like your mom. You have thoughts like your mom. You have energetic pathways like your mom, like if you're pathetic around money. As a woman, we're mainly trained to be pathetic, not generative, okay? So these are all physiological is what you lock into your body and psychological is how you think. So we've all these, hey, for Gita, hey Mary, hey Anne. So we've got all these physiological, let's call them points of views locked into our body. And also we've got the psychological points of views, which is how we think. And if you're out there today, just ponder on this question. You're an infinite being, what does that mean? An infinite being means that you have the capacity to function from unlimited. You can be, do, have, create, and generate anything. And most people I meet, including myself, have been so brainwashed into thinking that all that exists is a mediocre life where you, you know, put, your en put, the, put so much energy into creating the same thing and nothing changes. Now, how come I'm so passionate so grateful about access bars is that what I have seen in the seven years that I'm facilitating bars I have seen people going beyond that glass ceiling of I can't create a business I can't create money for me I thought I needed a man in my life I can't you know function without a man or a relationship so all of these are limitations that we have viewpoints about. What is your viewpoint about money? What is your viewpoint about creation? What is your viewpoint about your body? What is your viewpoint about your relationships? 
So when you come in and you get bars run, it's actually deleting the points of views that you've locked into your body so that you can let go of your programming. And access bars is an amazing transformational tool. It is, I can't even begin to tell you the changes that have I, I have actually witnessed with access bars being run. I've seen people having points of views that they're not good enough, you know, that they don't speak properly so they can't talk in public, that they're stupid, that they're wrong. So they have all these judgments, which is our total limitations. They get their bars run and they have this sense of, I can actually create my life. I can actually create a life that works for me. I can actually create money. I can actually create business. For me, I didn't know that I could travel around the world facilitating people to have a greater life, to have a better life. And Access Bars is about accessing you so that you can have a better life. And for me, I had this ache of dissatisfaction. I certainly wasn't happy. And I had a lot of stress with being a mom. I had a lot of stress, a lot of stress financially. And I had a lot of stress with my job and business. So the premises of this bars process is all of life with ease and joy and glory. So we have not been invited to live a life of ease. Do you get this folks? We have been given this template for life that it has to be difficult. Money has to be difficult. Relationships have to be difficult. Business has to be difficult. You cannot do business and have fun with business and create what you'd like to have in the world. What else? Families have to be difficult. So today, I just took a couple of moments to come on and talk to you about the most amazing process that I have added to my life which is Access Bars. And I teach this in London. I'm teaching it on the 15th of December, which is tomorrow week, a week from tomorrow. And I'm just inviting you. It's in 177 countries. And we have, mm, I think it's 10,000 practitioners. I would have to check that figure. Hey, Anne-Marie. And this process has, if you've had your bars run, and your life has changed and you've got free from limitation, if you've got free from, you know, negative thoughts and beliefs about yourself, please put it on the chat what bars has gifted to you in your life. For me, I'm going to start with, I hated my body. I thought I was ugly and oh my goodness me. So now I have actually a relationship with my body that is caring and nurturing and joyful. And I actually love having a body and I don't judge it anymore. So it changes your relationship with your body. It changes your relationship with yourself. It allows you to be kinder, more nurturing, more joyful. And most of all, it allows you to generate and create your life. So folks, Access bars, check it out, accessconsciousness.com, 177 countries. If you're out there, we're in a time of year that sometimes people can get depressed and get stressed. If you're out there today, I would just like to, you to know and to invite you that life can be better. It actually can be better. It 100%. Thank you, Anne-Marie, 33 330,000 practitioners. Holy moly. <laughs> 330,000 practitioners. I think that speaks for itself. Over 10,000 bars facilitators. Wow. So, and what I have seen continuously is people's lives are getting better. Their lives are getting better. So if you're out there today and you know life can be better and you know that your life is, doesn't have that sense of joy, sense of space, you're contracting a lot in your body, you know, please know that there is this amazing tool called Access Bars. You can go get a session with 330,000 practitioners all over the world. You can go do a bars class with 10,000 facilitators and your life will get better if you are willing to actually take, make a choice. So, hey, Paula, how you doing, my darling? 
So look at what you can do today. So here's what I'm going to finish with today. What is it that you can be and do today to create a tomorrow greater than today? And how do you create a different reality, folks? You ask for it. So that's my little conversation today. Please feel free to ask me questions about the bars, either by email or pop it on the Facebook here. What is it that you can actually be and do today to create your tomorrow? And how do you create your reality? You ask. What are you asking for? For me, I'm asking for more ease with the relationships. I'm asking for more ease with dealing with people. I, would, I used to get angry a lot. Anger is always a lie. I'm asking for more ease with money. I'm asking for lots of more money so we can get these tools all over the world. I'm asking for business to be done from what we can be, what we can do, business to be done from empowerment of another where we grow our talents and abilities and a world where we can actually enjoy having a body and not judge it and not make it wrong. So there's some of my asks that I'm asking for. Um, check me out, rachelobrien.org. Uh, and thanks for being in the world. And if you're choosing consciousness, consciousness receives everything and judges nothing. And it is the willingness to have a kinder world that we can all live in and have a greater set of choices. I just want to say thank you. Thank you for being in the world. And thank you for making my world a better place where we can actually enjoy life and live in the kingdom of we, which is contributing to each other's lives being greater. So thanks for that, folks. Bars class next Sunday in Uxbridge in London. Go check it out. All of life, let's finish with this, all of life with ease and joy and glory. All of life with ease, joy and glory. And remember, folks, there is no diminishment of self and energy. You are powerful beyond what you know. Bye for now. Thanks for being here. Happy Saturday.